Good morning. I'm on my way to the doctor's office. I just wanted you to see how beautiful the sky was looking this morning. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Thank you, Lord, for the beautiful blue sky, the puffy white clouds, and the temperature is not scorching hot today. So, oh wow, this is just awesome. So I want to take you with me for a little while. I don't know if they're going to allow me to have this uh, video inside the doctor's office, but either way it goes, um, I'm going to take you as far as I can. So just ride along with me, okay? All right. wiggling and carrying on with my camera because I don't have a holder for my car yet. So, um, well, I don't have a car, so I borrowed somebody's car to do what I need to do today. So, and they were so gracious as to let me um, borrow this car so I could go and take care of my business. Um, the doctor that I'm going to today is actually a weight management doctor. I used to see a weight management doctor a long time ago, and I was able to lose a significant amount of weight, uh, and I was able to get healthier uh, while I was seeing this doctor. But then uh, I decided that I could do the rest on my own, and of course, all of the weight came back and plus some. <laughs> so, so I'm going to try it again uh, with the weight management doctor. And I pray that uh, it's not too late. I haven't done, I pray that I haven't done irreversible damage to my body. Um, because I'm an old lady now, so. <laughs> but it's never too late to get healthy. It's never too late to get healthy. So, yeah, I watch how Yaya's Best Life and the Golden Girl and the Georgia Girl, how all of you ladies and Frugal Mama and everybody's getting healthy. And, and Miss B, but that just lets me know that it's going to take a little bit extra effort, especially when you're my age. You know, sometimes if you're younger, it's best to get it off, off of you the way uh, and try to get healthy when you're younger because it's a little bit harder uh, when you hit that 60 mark, 60 and over. I'm here to tell you. <laughs> So, um, that's what we're doing today, and that's what we're riding to. Um, I know some of you who live in my town, you'll be able to recognize my area <clears throat> and recognize this part of town where I am. So, um, yeah, have fun. <laughs> Trying to guess what part of town I'm on. Stop talking and let you enjoy the ride. actually riding with my window down today. I don't even have the air conditioner on because the temperature is so nice. Look at that motorcycle. 
that has to feel good riding today with your, the wind blowing in your hair, <laughs> blowing on your face. Here's a little bit of uh, information about me. As I was growing up as a teenager, I loved riding motorcycles. Yes, I even learned to drive a motorcycle. Of course, I had a guide on the back <laughs> telling me what to do, but yeah, that was a whole lot of fun for a young girl. So if you're young, get out there and have some fun. Experience life, different things. Uh, as long as you stay within the will of God, hey, you'll be all right. <laughs> stay within the will of God, you'll be all right. Okay, green light, I can keep going. I have my GPS on because I don't really know where this place is. This is my first visit coming here. Um, actually, I was going for the weight loss surgery, but because of my kidney disease, they told me that I wasn't eligible at this time. So, I want to talk to a nutritionist and see if I can get on the right road, get on a healthy regimen that can help me lose the weight, possibly not lose my kidneys and, uh, you know, other organs and things that I need to, to work my body. <laughs> um, yes, I hope I can stay healthy. trying to listen to the GPS. I hope I haven't rambled so much that I messed up my video because I think this is going to be a nice little ride along. <laughs> oh, look at the beautiful plants over here. Oh, that is gorgeous. It's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, to me, this is a beautiful part of town. Uh, It's always groomed so nicely.